an exhibition of different innovations all focused at addressing a number of challenges that the country is facing. One of the many innovations that have been showcased at this year's 53rd Jets Fair is this solar-powered hydraulic robot arm made by 17-year-old Daliso Kansembe from Chinsali, Muchinga province. The purpose of this robotic arm is to solve the world's solutions in, in stuff like fuel and crude oil. So we are trying to make an arm that we are trying to make, or I'm trying to make a robot that can work on clean fuel. Another innovation that has been made by 12-year-old grade 8 Pew Pew from Mazabuka, southern province, is an electric walking can for the blind. Inspired to make her grandfather's life easier, she has decided to share her innovation at this fair. It is going to process the information that was gotten from the ultrasonic sensor. And once if an object was detected, it is going to make, tell the buzzer to make a sound. And teachers too have exhibited their artificial intelligence innovations. Godfrey Kagusumbu from Masaiti on the Copper Belt province has come up with a surveillance robotic system which he says can be used to monitor border areas. Well, we needed maybe 10 personnel, we just deploy one of these because it is 360 degrees camera, it, can, it has high resolution, it is able to capture so many images and transmit them to one person. For the Ministry of Education, some of the innovations showcased here will be picked for further development. The ministries and the organizations, uh, the, our cooperating partners, work with these young people to sort of, uh, uh, um, you know, have a, a, a database or a bank where these young people, can, the, where the companies can tap in. Other participants have developed applications that will allow pupils to instantly access their results after a test while others have created apps that will enable parents and teachers to easily interact. Ruth Chainda, ZNBC News, Lusaka.